Alrighty guys, so I'm finally getting to actually get up the mountain after a good while. I've been off recovering for quite a while and I've been absolutely itching to get back up. So I'm, I'm heading back up the mountains now and um, I thought it was a perfect opportunity to just to show you this new Malazon jacket that's uh, Kathmandu's brought out. Real nice job, but um, I really want to just give it a quick test as we go up the mountains. So I'm just uh, traveling up there now at the moment, so looking forward to it. Looking forward to just getting up in the, in the fresh air again. Now it is very cold today. Uh, we're in the middle of winter. Um, obviously, in some countries, they'll be laughing at me saying the middle of winter there's no snow, but um, it, it, there's a real wind, uh, a real wind chill here in Ireland today. Um, so um, I hope you come with me, and we'll we'll see how we get on. All right, bye. I'll just show you quickly in the map. So we are at the moment. We are here. This, this stage. Uh, I'm just going to climb up here, um, right up to this peak, Melmore Lodge. Uh, sorry, Melmore. See Melmore. Sleeve Lock Shannon, and then down through this valley here, and um, across onto the the, 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 the Ulster Way here, and right back to the car. Okay, so we've just arrived here, and uh, I'm absolutely itching to get back up here, um, up the mountains. But just before we do, I thought it'd be a good uh, opportunity just to show you a few things about the, the jacket here before we go up um, talk a wee bit about it and then we'll, we'll go up and see how it really performs we'll just, just set the stuff down here awesome it's good to catch a wee breath first before you get up as well so a lot of people um, put a lot of layers on just before they go up and it's always a mistake that, that I've learned in my previous job you always just Get as much as I just have a small wee light t-shirt on here and then a jacket on top of that and that should be just enough in the middle of winter just to get you going so uh, yeah the Malazon jacket um, I've been wearing this for a couple of weeks now but again this is the first time bringing it up here but uh, it's it, this is a great steel of it and I really like it it's got uh, polyester the whole way through it 86% um, on the outside and it's got 16% elastin, and elastin's great because, especially when you're up here, um, it's got that stretch material, um, which is really, really good whenever you're actually climbing or having to move. Um, a lot of a lot of jackets I find can be very restrictive. So with this uh, jacket, it's been for, um, it's very good. It's, it's got that um, good material. Uh, also, um, it's got the DWR, which is uh, water repellent. It sort of encourages the water to run off it. And actually, might we just try to try show you that? We're down to the mountain stream here, and uh, if you can see this here, let me see if I can get it here. So you can see it just the water just rolls off it there. I don't know if you've seen that, but sure. <laughs> um, also, this is the, the, the grey steel of it as well, um, but it also comes in uh, dark olive, it comes in black as well. Um, it's coming out around about £110, I believe. Uh, I would need to check that price out, that was a wee while ago. So, um, But it also has uh, fleece the whole way through it, which I really love because it really gives it that nice um, it's one of these jackets yeah. where you can just zip up and off you go. You know, you can wear it. It's very stylish and sleek, so you can actually wear it going off into the town or with your mates or wherever you want to go, even to the office. But um, again, for me, it's up here. Um, this is where it really performs. Um, also, what I really like about this jacket is you've got uh, your your cord port here. I don't know if you can see that, but it separates the pocket from. Uh, from your from your phone or your media um, whatever you have in this pocket here it separates that and it keeps everything nice and dry and tidy uh, so you can just see that the headphones running right up here into there it's also got a wee hood here as well so it, again it always encourages that sort of um, separation between that um, so again it's got a wee uh, leather toggles I don't know if you can see that you just scoot up and the, the hood is all fleeced as well, which is really nice. So again, the YKK zips come right up the very top here. Like that, and you can see how, if you can actually hear me talk, you can see how cozy that would be in a really cold day when you're, when you're trying to get warm. So again, I really like it for that as well. And 
you've got the outer pockets here. Um, they're all lined polyester as well. All nice fleece material in it as well. So you got two on each side. Um, so again, guys, for me, uh, it's it's a it's a lovely jacket, but I want to see how it performs. It's and it's very very cold today. It's uh, it's about five degrees, but there's a real um, that's land. But as as we start to climb, it's going to be a lot colder. But again, uh, you've got a real wind chill here today. Um, so again, it's, it's just it's about keeping moving, and and when you stop, then you you, you need to get your outer outer shell on. But uh, let's see how we get on and, and stay with me. All right, so really, I'm just starting to climb here, um, and again, it shows you how cold it is when you start climbing. The wind chill is actually a lot more now. It always does amaze me too, though, how quickly your body temperature warms up once you actually start to walk. Um, so yeah, the jacket's doing well so far. <laughs> okay, so yeah, I can actually hear myself think now. So I'm just over the wall and what I want to do straight away is I want to get some uh, an outer shell on and so you can get nice and warm. Yeah, because you don't want to get that chill. This jacket that I'm putting on is also from Kathmandu on our down systems which I'll be speaking on in a different a different review but again some of their their gear at the moment that I'm that I'm seeing is just fantastic really really top quality so again all nice and cozy so what I felt with the jacket on the way up was that it was really nice it wasn't too hot because you don't want to get too hot either it was just it was absolutely perfect for me and uh, to be honest, um, being the first time out, I'm actually very, very impressed with it. Um, I certainly have used it in every, every other time I go out. Um, so again, and that's what it's all about. It's not a, you know, when I take a lot of grips up the mountains, the last thing I need to, to be thinking of is my, is my kit and, uh, and failing me. Some of the food that I'm eating, I like to bring up the mountain. There's uh, a lot of protein, a lot of snacks. Um, we've got hazelnuts. Uh, figs, dates, and uh, these uh, these bars, protein bars. So it's all good energy to put back into your body, and uh, a lot of the, the, the natural sugars as well. I nearly swallowed a date. Dear goodness, tell me back on track. Mm. Lovely. Okay, so jacket away, ready to go, but. Again, it's very tempting just to take off and, and you, you, you've got that narrow view. You've got that, your head down, ready to go. But it's always really good to, just to show you some of the, the reasons that we're here and the breathtaking views that you have up in the mountains in, in Ireland here, Northern Ireland. Okay, so we're just reaching the top of the first summit here. And just show you the view. Uh, there was a lot of mist coming over the top there. Um, but again, the wind is very strong here. Behind me here as well. Just near the end of our journey now. This is a path the link to the one so we're moving over so this is a this is where we first started coming up into that valley there so I'll just get down to the mountain stream and have a wee chat so that's that's me down back to the car again back down to our wee river so again I'll just take the kit off here and uh, we'll have our last wee review Okay. I get some water. It's been an absolutely lovely walk. Thoroughly enjoyed it. <coughs> Again, the uh, <coughs> coming down off the, the mountain there, 
with the, the wet grass as you're moving quite far, quite fast, which was a lot of fun. You need some skill, uh, skis or something. So again, um, the jacket for me performed very well. It really did. Um, and I'm going to be reviewing a lot more kit. Um, I have a lot more Kathmandu kit to, to review. I'm very excited about the stuff that they're bringing in at the moment. Um, again, for me, it's it, it's not about the weather. It's always about the right equipment when you're going up there. Uh, you'll always have the right equipment for the for, for the weather that you're going up into. Um, so yeah, I, I absolutely recommend this, and I'll always, always be honest with you. Um, I really do love this jacket. Uh, this jacket is. I uh, feel even a lot of jackets when you're finished you can feel very sweaty and very uh, too warm but this is just nice I actually just feel that light breeze coming through and it kept me warm the whole way up um, so again yeah very really recommend it so that's it uh, this is me signing off this is uh, Dave Orr from Magnetic North Adventures signing off in the in the Mourn Mountains so we'll see you all soon all right bye